okay, I'm gonna check this guy out here. Move this a bit. Alright. So it's cool to see now all splined out because you can now see um your timing some timing issues. Oh, it's mostly okay though. I'll check this through here. Yeah, it's cool. Um I think the main issue to me is, is beginning and the ending. So this you can see how this is very, very slow. Very, very floaty. You're up to here and you're ready. Uh, change this to uh, three seconds in, probably almost four. So this should be uh, <clears throat> that would be done. That's the timing of your sleeve bringing back, right? Okay, ready? <clears throat> Sleeves and go. Like all up, up up until here, all this section, you know, could be almost like twice as fast. So what you know, now it's kind of starting to uh, get your timing down on like what's kind of the attitude you want to do? Is it kind of a you know, given that he goes, it's going to be very decisive, and then a very quick move back for his sleeves. So that's your character moment there. Goes down, and then, uh, yeah, down there. Yeah. That's all cool. I like, I like all this. Here, and, then, oh, and this is getting there, too. I like this. That, the amount of speed is great. This is just a bit too fast still. Probably maybe twice the speed, or... Uh, 30%, 50% more, I don't know. I'll go twice and then go down a bit, but at the beginning here, ah, it's good. It's just the transition is still fairly abrupt where if you look at your curve, it would be like your Y would be something like this and then something like that. So really give it time to go, ah, to have a, a nice steady lift there. Ah, boom, oh, oh. Then here, yeah, I'll make sure that once you get to boom, there is no pause here. This is going to go immediately back. So if I bring down my quick time here. And then you have this guy here that will go directly into something like this. And then this will be from here on. I'm going to cut this. It will be something like like that. So the moment it hits him, go back. And then you would have to go like one, two, doo -doo -doo -doo, and quick steps. Right now it's all very even. One, two, three, four. So give this kind of a one, two, you know, slow, slow, fast. So you have some contrast there, like, whoa, whoa what's happening? And then we're getting control. Then it goes forward. Same thing here, like, da -da 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 fast. And then this would be like the first big one because he is going, like, momentum is going this way. Now he has to go this way. So that's going to be like a, it's going to be a long, long stretch there where he has to, you know, fight against gra gravity and everything. It's going to be so slow, slow, fast, 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 slow, fast, fast, fast. That's kind of the idea. And then you go, Rah, that's too fast. That's definitely going to be like Rah, maybe twice about the frames. Rah, and then the pause here is good. Then start to go back. I think once you go back here. Uh, it will be in something more like that. Like it's it's really pulling him back, um, and not so straight. I mean, this is just the beginning, so it really has to be fairly back to pull him backwards here. And then the drop, this needs to be about twice as fast too. Right now, boop, that's a bit too slow. Feel the, the physics there. And the landing will be, you know, as you get into it for detail. Like I wouldn't make this flat. Like you're. Your guy will probably be something more like that. And then potentially his arms down and the head here. And then it would flatten the way you have it here and have it go up and his arms will come with it. You know, kind of ragdoll and all awesome physics there. Um, but that's it. I would definitely work on, you know, let's get those broader strokes of timing in there. I wouldn't worry too much about, you know, feet sliding and stuff like that. This is all, you know, this is all detail stuff. To me, it feels like you got to have the main timing and the contrast and have a nice flow to the whole thing. And then we can go down and start breaking down uh, poses. You know, like here, I'll probably bring down the knee a bit more in so that you have a nicer bend. Because so you don't want to have knees straight towards you. Same with elbows. Because so if you do a squint test, it looks like it's just a straight leg and it's short. Anyway, stuff like that. We'll get to that later. Okay? Thank you. All right. 
there's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.